daylight has almost gone. The birds have sung their last. The bells call out to mass. Seat ye by my side for the night.
Sorry about that. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Welcome to Around the Shabbat Table, OneShouls.org's gathering around our virtual Shabbat Table, where we have a brief observance followed by a topic of discussion. Um, and uh, thank you. Uh, Shabbat Shalom, Bathsheba. Uh, very glad to see all everyone here. Glad to see lots of new faces. That's awesome. Uh, and uh, glad you could all make it. Uh, apparently, um, they're discussing in the chat room. Bear with me. My eyes are killing me. 
Um, there is a, was an anti-Semitic attack on a Jewish community center in a Jewish assisted living complex last Sunday. Three people were killed, each of them uh, Christian. And this is terrible. Um, we will definitely uh, include that in Misha Barak. Just please remind me. Um, so, uh, uh, I, I'm terrible at keeping up with, uh, events. I don't have a television. And, uh, right now, uh, everybody knows that I'm in the process of, uh, total life change and moving. And I am just working, 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 and working even more. Um, so, yeah, I'm just trying to get everything done. I just take time off for Shabbat, and I pretty much keep to myself. Uh, but I'd like to welcome everyone. Um, glad everyone can make it. And we'll get started with the candle blessing. I have already uh, lit my candles, which are just out of view down here. Um, I don't light my candles after dark. Um, that's just my preference, but feel free to... Uh, do your thing. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Ha'olam Asher Kidshanu Bemitvotav Vetivanu Lehad Likner Lehad Likner Shel Shabbat Amen. Um, we'll get into Kiddush. Eloheinu melech olam, bore pori hagafen, amen. Boruch atadonai, Eloheinu melech olam, asher kiddushonu b'mitzvah tov aratzavanu. The Shabbat Kod Show, the Ahava Uvrat Zon Hin Chilanu, Zikaron Lema Ase Voreshit, Kihu Yom Tehila, La Mikra Kodesh, Zeher Lesiat Mitzrayim, Kivanu Vachata, Vyotanu Kidashta, Mikohamim Vishabat Koshecha Vyahava Uvratzon Hin Chaltanu Baruch Ato Adonai Mekadesh HaShabbat Amen Shabbat Shalom my friend Amen. Um, we're going to get into Hamotzi. If anybody has to wash their hands, please let me know in the chat room so I can give you a chance to wash your hands and etc. Et um, uh, usually, uh, the usual people know that they have to wash their hands beforehand, but if you need to, please let me know because we have a lot of uh, uh, new people in here. And I do realize that there are special things we're supposed to do on Shabbat for uh, Pesach and uh, we're supposed to follow. And I apologize. Uh, my sidors are actually already packed up to be sent. Um, and I do not have that information available to me and I have not had a chance to look it up. I've been extremely busy. And uh, if there is something uh, you feel needs to be included, uh, please feel free to type it in the chat room. By the way, uh, guests, guests, uh, you can sign in by trying to type in the main chat room. You'll be prompted to uh, just follow the prompts. Uh, this is an interactive experience, and everybody gets involved. 
so please please go ahead and uh, go ahead and, and uh, type it in the chat room and apparently there is a huge 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 delay um, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do Hamalti Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Hamotzi Lechem Min Haaretz Amen. This brings us to the portion I like to call Blessings. We all know that Bad things happen during the week. We have a rough week. Uh, we're surrounded by negativity and, and bad things happening. Chaos, as I like to call it. Flat out chaos. Uh, you have to look for the good things that happen during the week. However small they may seem, they are still good things. Um, you know, a, a bunch of little flecks of gold uh, piled up equals the same thing as a big nugget of gold. So if you look for the little flecks of gold, you'll be rich in no time whatsoever. And uh, so uh, I ask that everybody in the chat room share at least one cool thing, blessing they've received this week, good thing that's happened to them this week, no matter how small it may seem. Uh, this week, uh, definite bonus, uh, I had $200 show up in my bank account, and I don't know where from. Uh, <laughs> you can't get any more of a bonus or a blessing than that. Uh, money magically appearing in your bank account, which is desperately needed at this point. So it was a definite, definite cool thing. Um, and of course, uh, the moments I got to spend with uh, my Bashirat, Miss Tracy, um, there, every moment is is definitely a blessing, um, even if it may may not seem like it at the time. Uh, you know, you have to learn to look at even some of the negative things as, as positive things and treat them as positive things and react as a positive thing. You know, things can go wrong. Uh, when they do, you have to know how to. Uh, handle it and deal with it in in a constructive manner and uh, you know uh, so if everybody could just share something in the chat room that they're thankful for this week or a blessing they received this week that would be awesome I know there's a huge delay I'm just rambling on here <clears throat> oh one other, one other blessing I received I have a guy at work um, Everybody knows I work in a pet store, and this is, I, I worked there since we opened. This is, you can't really see it. Let me try to get up here. <clears throat> there you go. If, if you look right here, this is the first Pac-Man frog uh, that we had in our store ever, and it was the first Pac-Man frog I ever saw, sold. And uh, the guy was really intrigued by it and really went out of his way and such. Uh, and and uh, he had to uh, get rid of the frog. And I've always been intrigued by a Patman frog. And today he brought it in to me. He says, I know you're gonna, he's going to have a good home. So I want you to take care of it. So I, I thought that was a blessing. Um, yeah. <laughs> Tracy says she's not washing her hands, but playing another thrilling game of stop the ferret from burning himself on the Shabbat candles. Uh, and I will take care of that with the new shelving units when we get into the new apartment, Miss Tracy. Put that on the honeydew list, please. Uh, no, it doesn't learn. Well, that's not true. I can't say that. It, it, the problem is he only listens to me. So I'm sure once... Uh, once I get there, we, we can square this away. And another funny story about that is uh, the ferret has actually tried to Skype me five times. Uh, yeah. 
yes, there's a huge, huge, huge delay, and I apologize about that. Um, if does anybody have any blessings I like to share for this week besides the ferret actually not burning himself? I think I have about a minute and a half delay actually, which is the longest delay I've ever had. And uh, the reason for that is because the 505 server is presently being repaired. Um, it went down twice earlier. Um, for those of you who don't know, the 505 is a very huge server and we happen to be routed through it apparently at the present moment. Um, so that, that would be the reason why. Okay, well, while you folks type in your blessings, what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to play the Shema now, and then I'll read your blessings after the fact, because there is just a massive delay um, with the broadcast, and I apologize about that. But we'll go ahead and do the Shema. It's customary to stand for the Shema. If I do that, you won't see me, and that's not very much fun. It'll take me a little second to fix it up, too, but... Shema Yisrael Adonai Elohim Adonai Echad Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai happening this week. Um, Doc says he's glad not to be a slave to Pharaoh and that's definitely always a good thing. Um, Troy says he had a doctor's visit this week uh, this week and a great cabal lesson. Oh my goodness I remember my cabal lesson. I, I am not a mystical kind of guy in any way shape or form. Uh, that about wiped me out. Uh, you, you're also moving in June so far. Awesome. Uh, <coughs> everybody's moving. Um, Tracy, looking for your blessing. I thought you had one when you signed in, into the game today. That could be a blessing right there. Uh, number two, you actually got through the week. Uh, number three, your headache's gone. I could go on and on and on. Uh, and uh, we got the uh, applications in for the apartment. Um, Scott says, I was on vacation this week. <laughs> that is definite blessing. That is awesome. That's good to hear. Uh, Ariella says, uh, 
set her with family and with one shul with one shul the next day. There you go. That's awesome. Um, how was everybody's setter? Tell me about it. Um, did you have a good setter? Um, uh, what's funny is that uh, the the uh, family I rent from uh, they want me to do Easter eggs with them tomorrow, so I call them the uh, the Pesach eggs. So we'll be coloring the Pesach eggs tomorrow, which I really love coloring eggs. I don't care. I really, really love coloring eggs. And next year at Setter, I got a feeling we're gonna we're gonna be uh, coloring the eggs for the Setter. It, it, I, I, is there anything in a halakha that is is that uh, says I can't do that? Please let me know. Um, so it sounds like everybody's had really good blessings with, with this week. That's awesome. Um, um, so with that, we'll get into. Um, Misha Barak wishes to pray for healing. Um, the list is uh, obviously limitless, but we definitely need to include uh, Miss Sarah. Uh, feel free to. Uh, she is desperately looking for somebody to play um, Scrabble with her on Facebook. So if, if you do enjoy playing Scrabble, uh, hit up Miss Sarah and have a awesome game of Scrabble. She is extremely good. Um, I have played her uh, often. Uh, Miss Tracy, um, she definitely uh, uh, has some things going on that we need to get taken care of and um, um, has some uh, appointments coming up shortly that I wish I could be there for, but I can't be there for that and then be out there at the end of May at the same time, so we kind of had to make a tough decision. Um, uh, I'm trying to think who else. Uh, Miss Vicky. Uh, Miss Vicky, she thought she had a job and they turned around and ended up giving it to someone else. Um, so that that's proving to be a little bit stressful. Um, and uh, so uh, we'll get on with Nisha Barak. Uh, me mm -hmm. 